Hey, what's up guys? I've got an unboxing here for you that I have been, well, it's release day today, but it's, I was hoping I'd get it, well, that's unfair because yesterday was Veterans Day, so I guess this is the soonest I was going to get it, unless I got it on Saturday or something, but um, anyway, who cares, right? <laughs> this is the Meg, the Best Buy exclusive steelbook with this new design logo that they've I've not been using very much at all. It is a 4K because they all are these days, even though I don't use it, but... It's the Meg. It's the Ultra Jaws film. Um, I haven't seen it. I've heard, um, well, mostly bad things. And you can hear that it's moving around in there, which is lame, but whatever. Luckily, they're Blu-ray and 4K. Although, I've heard 4K is actually pretty easy to scratch, so that's kind of lame. It is, is it actually glossy? It's... It is, well, wait, is it, is it, it was kind of a dent, is that a dent? Well, not really. If that's the only dent I have in there, I'll take it. It's a, a very minor little dingish looking thing. Uh, there's the, well, that's not the spine, that's a stupid layover. It's not the spine. And there's a spine splash over the thing. Look at that stupid bullshit. How? How's that happen? It's got, it's covered up by this. What the fuck? Anyway. Um, just one piece of glue on there. That's kind of cool, I guess. I don't even know the premise of this film. There's a picture of the fucking... the mouth of it. It's kind of got some... blotches on there? What's with that? How is it dirty? Well, whatever, I guess. Giant... If that's, it's got a giant mouth. It's a giant maw. Look at that. Actually, it's really annoying. It's right on the lettering of the Meg. Ugh. Stupid. Anyway, it's got kind of a... Well, actually, it's not really glossy. It's, I guess it is matte. Never mind, it's matte. Um, the, the lettering is a little glossy-esque. It's got a metallic look to it. Anyway, it's a uh, steelbook starring... Wait, no, that's starring. Steelbook from Best Buy about a big, giant, ultra-megalodon shark. I think it'll probably stay on the back here. Let's take a look at that quick. Big shark, big action, big fun. Um, like I said, I was saying before I started babbling, um, I, I've heard mostly, well, I've heard mostly mixed things, mostly negative-ish things, but I've heard from other people that it was a pretty good time, actually, if you just chuck your brain type of thing. But, um, you know, I've, I don't know. I'm not even really sure why I bought it. I was This is probably something I could have got a code for and been happy with it, but I did kind of like the design of the um, steelbook here. It's a gigantic maw. Anyway, uh, there's the synopsis. Synopsis, and it is. It says, um, yeah, and from the clutches of a megalodon, a prehistoric seventy-five foot shark who believe once believed to be extinct. Uh, Journey oceanographer, recruits expert rescue diver Jonas Taylor, teamed with Yoshinaga's daughter, Suyin. Suyin. Li Bingling. Isn't she the person who's missing from China? I don't remember. Maybe. I don't know. Taylor must try to outwit the greatest predator alive. A killer he's faced once before. He's faced a megalodon before? That'd be crazy. Uh, John Turtletop. That's a name that's familiar to me. I don't know what else he's done. And it is a... Is this a Warner Brothers film? Yeah, it's Warner Brothers. And they are all on the fucking movies anywhere train now, so that's whatever. Um, so anyway, there's the cover. The 4K disc is just rolling around back here. Is it scratched? It looks okay. Hold on, actually. What is that? This is a survey to talk about the Meg. What? I thought this was the, the, the UV code, but it's a survey. The UV code's on the back here. That's weird. Huh. Anyway. Here is the 4K disc. Just some teeth around it. And here's the exact same thing. It's a Blu-ray, but it's not, like, white. It's more silver and clear. And there's the scene of people being eaten, I think, or something. Oh, it's just people at a beach. I guess that's not as cool. Hmm. 
The stupid fucking spy slice is gonna piss me off, but whatever. Okie dokie. What if this looks good in uh, 4K? I know that it was a 3D release too. I think that was actually exclusive to Best Buy, so I don't know if this has got a lot of D, uh, 3D theatrics in it or anything, but um, if you're interested in that, Best Buy did have one. I feel like I'm not seeing 3D at all anymore. Such occasionally in situations like this where it's an exclusive. 3D is basically, I don't know if it's completely dead, but it's not around. It was just a couple of years ago that it was everywhere. And now it's, everyone's on the 4K train. The leg. Cool beans. So that is it. Um, like I said, I'm not really exactly sure why I bought this. I think I'm just so used to just buying brand new Steelbook Blu-rays that I just I bought this one too. And it was, it had some hype around it. I don't think when I, when I pre-ordered it, I heard... Really, very, not very much about it. Just that it was a shark type movie and Jason Statham was in it. And I thought, well, sold. Hmm. Well, I just saw that it says Rain Wilson on here. Uh, Rain Wilson was uh, Dwight on The Office. And I really liked that show. Jason Statham, Lee Bing Bing. Or Ly oh, yeah. uh, Rain Wilson, Ruby Rose, Winston Chow, and Curtis. No, oh, shit. Cliff Curtis. Ruby Rose plays the same character in every film. Sorry. <laughs> I don't mind her, but she's... Apparently one note from what I've seen, so I, I guess I'm curious to see if she's just the rugged, like, ultra-cool, skinny girl with tattoos in this, and she's, like, sarcastic and shit. I don't know. I'm just fucking talking on my ass. Um, that's a giant-looking shark. So anyway, I'll watch this at some point. Probably not anytime soon. I keep buying shit and not watching it because that's just how I roll. But, um, anyway. Oop, here we go. So yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I've got... A bunch more shit to unbox because I can't stop buying crap. But thank you for watching. I'll see you again in more videos and whatnot. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around. Bye.